Welcome to my Vancouver house. Come on in. I'm gonna show you around. Okay, so this is the basement portion. Sometimes I'll come down here, stick handle, do some stretching. We got golf balls and sticks everywhere down here. It's a good space to just dangle it out whenever I'm bored. We also got the foam roller here. Do some uh, rolling out and do a lot of stretching, like I said. We got the Theragun here. This thing is, thing is magic. Keeps me nice and loose. Really like that. Uh, this is the tripod I used to film a lot of my Instagram videos. Just put the phone in here. Wanted to do some dangles, stuff like that. Got a couple true sticks here. This is for when I'm playing games or going to train or make videos. Just keep these by the front door. Got a whole bunch down there. Just got this shipment in from Sideline Swap. Uh, we'll explain that in a later video, but come on in. I'll show you the rest of the house. And of course, right by the front door, we got my Mars blades. These are the new ones they made with Verbero. These are my old ones. These are for indoor with the indoor wheels, a little bit grippier. And these are the first ever ones I got in Vancouver. Love these things, I'm on them all the time. So they stay right by the front door. Okay, so right as you come through the front door here, we got my gym. I built this uh, probably six months ago. Really wanted to have my own home gym to work out in. I hate being in public gyms, having to share stuff. Uh, wait for stuff, go at uh, the hours that they have because I work weird hours sometimes. So just have everything I need here. We got the Olympic barbell set, a uh, bunch of bumper plates so I can toss them down on the ground. Uh, we got these guys, these are the power blocks. These are pretty sweet. If I want to adjust the weight, so right now they're at 60. If I want to adjust them to have them at 30, I'll just clip them in like that, change the weight. Don't have a lot of space here, so I can't have too much, uh, too many dumbbells around. And then we got our, my kind of corner where I just toss everything in. It's not too, uh, too clean here, but we got my hockey equipment when I'm playing games, a whole bunch of stuff, old equipment, uh, stuff people send me, we have here. It's kind of just like a storage space. I got a, a bunch, of, bunch of crap in. I, I couldn't even tell you what's in some of these. We got like, hundred wheels in here for roll rollerblading. Just a whole bunch of stuff. Probably should organize that one day, but I'm moving, so I'm not organizing it. All right, and as you can see, I have a bunch of pictures here. So these are from my Molson Canadian experience where I was one of the 11 winners of a contest to play hockey on top of a mountain, only accessible by helicopter. Some really cool pictures they got uh, for me. There's one there. We got one here shooting on my buddy Mike. Pretty cool mountain backdrop. This is the rink what it looked like uh, from afar. Pretty legendary, there's nothing else around except a rink. Uh, one of my favorite photos, I just found this one uh, on, uh, what is it called, Google. <laughs> it's just uh, a Photoshop net uh, with a bunch of open ice. These kind of photos just, uh, I really love to have around. It's just the place I'd wanna be uh, for a long period of time, and I know I have a really good time doing it. We got one more actually in the bathroom here. My favorite photos to look at, uh, it's just a kid on an open rink. I imagine having like a cottage area here and just going out, playing some puck. Uh, it just reminds me of me growing up, just going on the rink, just to have a good time. We kind of put this quote here, it's out here we realize why we all play the game, to have fun. Uh, you know, it's just a kid out there with a puck, no stress, no coach, no expectations, just having fun, but also getting better at the game. I think that's a large part of development as well, so I like to have that close to home. So we have this doorbell looking thing here. I've, <laughs> I've lived here for like a year and a half. I have no idea what it does. Um, really been bugging me? So, but there's no answer. So it kind of pisses me off a bit. All right, so here's where I do all my editing. Uh, just a simple setup, laptop, pull out here when I have my notes and stuff like that. Uh, not a whole lot going on here. This is where I do the audio, have my mic, uh, look at YouTube videos and stuff like that. So this is where I get all that stuff done. This is where I watch TV, chill on my couch, my futon here. It's actually pretty sweet. When I have buddies over, I can just go like this and take this out. Turns into a bed real quick. Ikea made, legendary. I like this a lot. I have people over a lot, put a little mattress on that, let them stay over. A lot of Fortnite gets played here. Not a lot of W's, but a lot of hours logged in. Uh, I play on my Xbox, look at Netflix. Uh, I'm not on the TV a lot, usually only when I'm eating or maybe at the end of the night I'm here. Uh, and this is where I have my floorball stick when I'm watching games. 
I'm usually stick handling in between uh, commercial breaks and intermission and stuff like that. So love having the floor ball stick handy at all times. And then we'll bring you into the bedroom where the magic happens. Just kidding. Come on. Okay, and you might have noticed I have that silver play button uh, kind of just sitting here on the ground. Before he came, it was actually like that, so I did present it quite well for you guys. Uh, but this was for 100,000 subscribers. Thank you all for subscribing. Uh, I'm not really a big like trophy guy or anything like that, so I'll just leave it on the ground there. But thank you all for getting me to 100,000. The silver play button. Okay, welcome to the bedroom. You might notice on my right here, I got about a thousand sticks. Uh, this is the stick wall where I put uh, the sticks companies send me. I use a lot in videos. I do give a lot away sometimes to, to buddies or stuff like that. We have some at the lab as well, so there are more. Got a giant bed. I was very particular about this guy. Went to sleep country, lied on about 12 beds until I found this one was just right. It's really big because I roll around and I've been told by people I kick them in my sleep. So uh, I need a lot of space. I'm very active when I sleep. Uh, I love to read. Right now I'm reading The Alchemist. So I have uh, whatever book I'm reading, I usually leave on this table. Whenever I'm heading out, uh, I bring one with me. This is the mattress that people stay on when they come stay with me. There's a balsamic vinegar stain right there. My bad, that was on me, but it's uh, as clean as it's gonna get. And if you're looking for a free place to stay, you're sleeping on balsamic vinegar and you're not going to complain about it. So let's bring you guys out to the best part about living here, which is the garage where all the dangling and all the fun stuff, you've probably seen it in videos, all that stuff happens out there. So let's head out. Hey, a dime. Yeah, lucky day. I can pay you now here. Thanks hey. for filming, bud. Thanks. I'll take I'm this. It. Here's the uh, backyard area. This is where I keep my bike. I road bike everywhere. Uh, this is the lawn. I keep it really green uh, most of the time. It might not look green now, but usually it looks pretty good. Uh, come on down. We'll show you the, uh, the garage area here. Spend most of my time here. I love it. Get that goalie stick out of here. So this is the epic garage area. So yeah, we shoot a lot of a lot of pucks here. Really good way to relieve any stress and just have fun. Work a lot on both forehand and my favorite shot, the backhand. Just ripping them all day long. We have some workout coming. I do some workouts out here as well. Usually I do my core stuff out here, so I just have the ball. Uh, we got some some bands here. Usually we invite some elite level goalies uh, to come train with me. So we always got them in the best gear that we could possibly find. That's the garage area. It's legendary. I love it here. I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss it, man. Yeah.